Greetings, fellow explorers of the mind. Today, we're delving into the fascinating concept of the dual nature of consciousness, a topic that Neville Goddard often highlighted in his teaching. This concept is pivotal in understanding how our minds shape our reality. It's about recognizing the interplay between our conscious and subconscious minds and how this dynamic duo influences our experiences, our creations, and ultimately, our lives. What is the dual nature of consciousness, you may ask? Imagine your mind as an iceberg. The tip that peaks above the surface is your conscious mind, the thoughts, feelings, and perceptions you're aware of at any given moment. But beneath the surface lies the vast, hidden realm of your subconscious mind, the storehouse of your beliefs, memories, and deep-seated pattern. This is the dual nature of consciousness, the conscious and the subconscious working in tandem to shape your reality. The interplay between your conscious and subconscious minds is a continuous dance that influences every aspect of your life. Your conscious mind sets the direction, the goals, the desires, but it's your subconscious mind that holds the power to manifest those desires to turn your visions into reality. It's the fertile ground where your thoughts and beliefs take root and blossom into your experiences. Understanding the dual nature of consciousness is like having the key to the control room of your life. It empowers you to become a conscious creator, to align your conscious desires with your subconscious beliefs and to orchestrate the symphony of your reality. It's about recognizing the power of your thoughts and emotions to shape your experiences, your relationships, and ultimately, your destiny. Neville Goddard placed great emphasis on the power of the subconscious mind. He famously stated, the subconscious is what a man is. The conscious is what a man knows. This encapsulates the profound influence our subconscious mind has on shaping our identity, our actions, and ultimately, our lives. Our subconscious mind is the silent partner in the dance of life, orchestrating our perceptions, beliefs, and behavior. It's the storehouse of our deepest held convictions, our ingrained habits, and our automatic responses to the world around us. While our conscious mind may set intentions and make choices, it's our subconscious that often dictates our actions and reactions. Understanding the power of the subconscious is crucial in Neville Goddard's teachings. He believed that by consciously influencing our subconscious mind, we can effectively shape our reality. This involves recognizing and challenging limiting beliefs, replacing them with empowering ones that align with our desires. Goddard further described the subconscious mind as the realm of infinite possibilities where everything is known, everything is possible. This concept emphasizes the boundless nature of our subconscious, suggesting it is a source of unlimited potential and creativity. According to Goddard, our subconscious mind is not merely a storage space for memories and past experiences, but a dynamic force that shapes our reality. It is the wellspring from which all creation arises, the driving force behind our manifestation. Within its depths lie our deepest desires, our hidden talents, and our unrealized potential. Goddard's teachings suggest that by tapping into the power of our subconscious mind, we can unlock these hidden treasures and create the life we desire. This involves recognizing the subconscious as a fertile ground for our thoughts and beliefs, nurturing them with focused attention and unwavering faith. By understanding the infinite nature of our subconscious mind, we can transcend limitations and embrace the boundless possibilities that lie within. It is about recognizing that we are not merely limited beings defined by our past, but infinite creators capable of shaping our reality in accordance with our deepest desires. Friends, the connection between our conscious and subconscious minds is a continuous feedback loop. Goddard explained, what we are conscious of is constructed out of what we are not conscious of. Our conscious thoughts, feelings, and perceptions 
are rooted in the deep-seated beliefs and patterns held within our subconscious. The subconscious mind is not merely a passive recipient of our conscious thoughts. It's an active force that shapes our reality. Goddard stated, our subconscious assumptions alone have the power to say, let us make man objective manifestations in our image after our likeness. Our subconscious beliefs are the blueprints from which our experiences are constructed. Goddard beautifully described the creative process, stating, the whole of creation is asleep within the deep of man and is awakened to objective existence by his subconscious assumptions. Our subconscious mind is the fertile ground where our desires take root and blossom into reality. Even when our conscious mind rests, our subconscious remains vigilant, working tirelessly to manifest our belief. Goddard explained, within that blankness we call sleep, there is a consciousness in unsleeping vigilance. And while the body sleeps, this unsleeping being releases from the treasure house of eternity, the subconscious assumptions of man. Goddard often emphasized the importance of prayer as a means of accessing and influencing the subconscious mind. He stated, prayer is the key which unlocks the infinite storehouse of the subconscious mind. Through prayer, we can consciously plant the seeds of our desires into the fertile ground of our subconscious. The subconscious mind is highly receptive to suggestion. Goddard explained, the subconscious mind is completely controlled by suggestion. This means that by consciously choosing our thoughts and beliefs, we can effectively program our subconscious mind to create the reality we desire. Goddard suggested that the ideal state for accessing and influencing the subconscious mind is through controlled reverie, a state of relaxed focus where the conscious mind is passive but alert. He described it as a concentration of attention where we can effectively plant the seeds of our desires into the subconscious. The applications of the dual nature of consciousness are limitless. If you desire happiness, consciously cultivate feelings of joy and contentment, allowing those feelings to seep into your subconscious. If success is your goal, embody the confidence and determination that come with achievement impressing those qualities upon your subconscious. If you yearn for health, cultivate the sensations of vitality and well-being, allowing your subconscious to embrace those feelings as your reality. And if abundance is what you seek, feel the gratitude and satisfaction of financial freedom, allowing your subconscious to manifest that abundance in your life. The journey of understanding and harnessing the dual nature of consciousness is a process of self-discovery and conscious creation. It requires patience, persistence, and a willingness to explore the depths of your own mind. It's about recognizing the power of your thoughts and beliefs to shape your reality and taking responsibility for the garden of your mind. As we conclude this exploration into the dual nature of consciousness, I invite you to reflect on the profound interplay between your conscious and subconscious mind. Remember, your conscious mind is the gardener and your subconscious mind is the fertile soil where your thoughts and beliefs take root and blossom into your reality. Understanding this dynamic duo is key to unlocking your creative potential and shaping your life in accordance with your deepest desires. By consciously choosing the thoughts you nurture and the beliefs you embrace, you can cultivate the garden of your mind and manifest the abundance, joy, and fulfillment you see. If you found this video insightful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who might benefit from these teachings. And if you'd like to stay updated on our latest videos and explorations into Neville Goddard's work, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Thank you for joining me on this journey into the depths of consciousness. May these insights empower you to become the conscious creator of your life, to manifest your dreams, and to live a life filled with purpose and fulfillment. Until next time, may you harness the power of your conscious and subconscious minds to create the reality you desire.